have children from every corner of Palestine. And every day there is more. My goal is to educate these kids and give them hope. Palestinians write their history today in many different ways, especially visually. Now cinema is one of the main ways we are expressing ourselves through, especially document our history. But to read the autobiography Miral that Rula Jibril wrote, and to read the adaptation, the way the script was done, was an amazing, a beautiful surprise. Ho scritto questo libro nel 2003 e l'ho scritto come omaggio a una a un mentor, a una madre. E anche l'ho scritto pensando alla grande forza dell'amore di mio padre, di della mia terra, della mia insegnante. I have to get rid of them. Where do I put them? What are you doing here? You come home with me. He is not for you. Yahaj, she is not for you. Some of you might have heard that there is an uprising, what has been called the Intifada. It means stand up straight. Anything you do is political. If you tell somebody else what you're thinking, it's political. I felt it was my responsibility to confront this issue because uh, maybe I spent most of my life uh, receding from going to Israel, receding from my responsibility as a Jewish person. And, uh, and this gave me an opportunity to protect something that my mother had spent her life trying to build. Hey, Ismail, Ismail. Miran, Mother Virja, you miss you. I think he will drop you in his universe as a painter, as an artist. And I think it's very interesting because it's very different from a classical sort of way of how other directors would approach an actor. Uh, I, I think you go with the flow with him, really. You just like don't resist anything because if you do, it's painful. And I think it's very interesting to be able to kind of be a color or a brush in his hand and just like follow, follow his emotion. I am a Palestinian refugee born and grew up in Lebanon. And I have reached that place. I am in Venice today with an international movie because I got the chance to finish my studies in school in Beirut and to go to university in Paris to dance, to learn more about my passion. Education is basically like the way for you to draw your own destiny, right? And to try and think, and try and analyze, and try and put yourself in the shoes of others, and try and watch, and try and observe, and come to conclusions, and participate really, and just like taking responsibility about what's happening to you, and not leave it to others to kind of like decide for you what has to happen in your life. So this is universal. That's a good name for a school. Children's Home.